As the island is in the midst of shooting season has been increased in numbers of people out and about with firearms. The new police department continue with their campaigns to caution firearm owners to avoid any unnecessary accidents, especially we head off to the festive season. We spoke to the chief of police about the regulations in terms of distances people are allowed to use firearms and safety issues. Under the Act, it's, uh, they shouldn't be shooting within 100 metres of a residential area. Um, I mean, I, I appreciate that's sometimes difficult to judge. Uh, I know last season uh, I had a number of calls at home with um, people whose pellets had fallen on their roofs. And obviously if that's happening, somebody's closer than 100 metres away. Um, I would encourage people that if this does happen or if they have got concerns to contact us. It's not always the easiest thing to police. Um, what I've tried to say on the radio on a, on a Monday morning and certainly here now for, for the listeners at home is um, from our point of view, gun safety, gun security, um, common sense approach is paramount. Um, we've seen probably via New Zealand news um, on TVNZ some of the tragic results of, that have happened lately with regards to hunting accidents uh, and certainly not something I would want for a peak here. Um, so it's just the common sense rules. Treat every firearm as loaded. Um, finger off the trigger until a target is identified. Uh, and security of the weapon when you're not using it, um, i.e. not leaving it in the back seat of the car, um, not leaving it where kids can access it because that's when a tragedy can strike. Gun safety is always an issue and especially now with the opening of the shooting season. There are more people ab about and scanning the skies for some local delicacies for the festive season. You've mentioned that uh, there are regulations in terms of distances from residential homes. Uh, there have been cases where uh, some have uh, decided to, I guess, uh, use their firearms as they're in their vehicles, you know, scanning the skies for, for birds. Uh, what can members of the public do if they do see that occurring? Because that is actually quite dangerous. Yeah, certainly I'd be concerned if, um, if that was correct. Uh, again, we haven't had any official reports from it um, ourselves. Um, I certainly wouldn't be encouraging people to be shooting from their cars, um, certainly not when they're moving either. Um, and we'd take a very dim view of that if such a complaint was made. The shooting season, which began on the 1st of November and ends on the 1st of January 2011. The arrival of the ship also means ammunition is now on sale with more than sufficient supply. We had a solid week this week with um, ammunition sales and that was probably as a result of the um, cargo ship, the reef cargo ship, uh, arriving late um, as a result of having going to, going to Rarotonga because of the bad weather here. Um, we, were, we had previously sold out, so this week was a nice, um, nice time for it to arrive just before um, moving into the festive season. So um, we've had a busy week with, with ammunition sales. The message is for firearm owners to be responsible and exercise common sense during this shooting season. And there will be no extension despite the slight delay of ammunition.